Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Pinario, so welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Today, we are going to talk to Marine at the party after whatever the heck that last episode was, where I had to basically run from four or five different mercenaries. But we finished that. We lowered the nation power of Paros, and so now we're back on Naxos to go talk to Marine. So let me hop up here to the party. I could have fast traveled here, but got to do my intro. So we will get up to the party and we will talk to her. All right, Marine. Did you not hear what I said? These are their most skilled killers. You cannot stay in the public eye. They'll find you. I understand you perfectly, but I also need to be seen. The propagandist did his job well. I need more support to attack Baros. I've seen too many people die already. Please, come away from here. Spasia? What brings you here? Cassandra! Read the room, my dear. I'll play along, you're reacting strangely. I'm interrupting. Please, continue your discussion. It sounds fascinating. I've just come to tell your mother that the cult's elite forces are after her, and that this place is too open. And I've been telling Aspasia I need to appear in public to maintain the support of the citizens. You want me to handle the cult soldiers? Not only that. My people won't believe Paros is behind this without proof. I need you to find it. Of I course. can do that. Good. And I'll make the rounds here. Shore up my support. Be careful. They're dangerous. So am I. I. Know. I'll get her out of here safely. I don't trust Aspasia. I still think she is the leader of the Cult of Cosmos. I'll show you why in a bit. But let's see, where do I find these killers? What proof do you think I'll find? Where do your sources say I should start looking? I'd try the caves under Mount Zas. The cultists are so enamored with their own mysticism. It's predictable enough for them. I don't think anyone sent to kill you is going to admit who they're working for. You're right. Physical proof is better. I'm sure you can find something. Alright, let's do it. I'd be happy to help you both. I'll see you again later. Hopefully. Alright, so let's take a quick look at the cultist menu, and I can show you why I think Aspasia is the ghost of Cosmos here. So I only have three out of eight clues for her because I've killed three of her sages. But let's go ahead and take a look. So, the ghost longs for freedom. The ghost is planning to herald a new era, and the ghost controls Athenian politics. And she's a woman. And what we know from her and Pericles is that she definitely cares about the Athenians. So, I mean, I know this is probably pretty thin, but I really think that she is the ghost of Cosmos. But I assume we'll see that later on when we, when I take out the rest of the sages. But let's go ahead and find these assassins. The assassins are hiding on Noxos. They might operate from caves to the north of Zeus's cove. The cave of Mount Zas is likely their hideout. All right, where's this cave of Mount Zas? I'm pretty sure I've been to all of the places on this island. But let's see if we can find this cave of Mount Zas. Is that Mount Zas there? No, that's Zeus's overwatch. Zeus's what? Zeus's overwatch, okay. Cave of Mount Zas. Okay, that's where we're headed. I know I've been there. Alright, I will meet you guys at the cave. Alright, we're approaching the cave of Mount Zas now. This shouldn't be too hard unless they've changed the enemy types that were in here. I don't exactly remember who was in here before. I'm guessing it was just bandits or pirates. But let's do it. Too far down. Yep, I knew it. All right, back up here, Cassandra. That was a good dive, but a little bit too far. All right, nobody at the entrance. All right, let's go find these people. Got my teleport assassination ready. And I also got this pretty cool ability where I can call in one of my lieutenants to distract a group for me. So just in case I need a little bit of backup. I'll be fine. I'm not really here for gems right now, but I might as well pick these up. Okay, so they're just soldiers. Interesting. 
Were there always soldiers? Probably. Okay, we got one guy there that I can take out right now. Okay, that's one. Yeah, you go over there. Let's take out your friend over here. Okay, I don't know why that's being so weird. I could take this guy out if I get uh, enough adrenaline. There we go. Oh, what's that? You know you want to check that out. You go check that out, and I'm going to go over here and kill your friend. Hello. Oh, whoa. Well, get over here. I know you don't notice me, so I'm going to do a running assassination. Nope, didn't kill you. Alright, we'll take you out. I'm just gonna let you burn. You're gonna die. <laughs> that poor guy. Okay, find and kill the assassins. I'm assuming there's more somewhere. I don't see any evidence. At least nothing that stands out as evidence. So let's go deeper into the cave. We could go that way, but I think that might be a way out. So let's go up this ladder over here first. And then we'll check back on the other side. Yep, deeper into the cave. This is definitely where we need to go. This looks like a fight. Okay, who do you think has more health? I'm gonna say the big guy. But it's probably the smaller lady. Let's go for it. I love that I can do this. Gosh, she's so powerful. One stamped with a seal of Paros. And a letter. Some kind of code. I can't believe she told me to be careful. She should have told them to be careful. Alright. <laughs> Let's get the heck out of here. That was that was insanely awesome. All right, so I think that's everything. I don't want to go around and get all the gems in this room, so let's just let's get out of here. I think we can get out the other way that I was gonna go, so we should be able to just hop over there. All right, I'll meet you guys back at Marina, unless anything special happens. All right, we're approaching Marina now. I'm glad this is not a restricted zone, excuse me. Let's get up here. Everything all good? Everything's all good. For now, I guess. The cult soldiers were paid with Rachmi from Paros. Well, I could hardly ask for clearer proof. This will settle some scores. Take this to the Merchants Guild. Tell them it's the proof I promised. And tell them they can keep the coins. Of course. There was also this. I assume it's their orders. I recognize this. It's an old dialect. The cult must use it to communicate with one another. You can read it? Of course you this can. This money isn't from Silanos. It's from someone in Sparta. That's not possible. I can translate it for you, but these orders come from a Spartan king. The Spartan nobility has always resisted the cult. The cult is like water. Any crack in the stone and they'll get in. Sparta stands against corruption. Sparta has always been corrupt. Sparta has changed. Sparta has changed since we were there. Corruption spreads everywhere, as Aspasia says, even to Sparta. They want to instill discipline across the Greek world while they rot from within. They're focused on the wrong enemy. I am still Spartan. And so are you. Are you really? I have responsibilities here. Paros needs to be stopped. But then, yes, I will go back. Okay, we got another cultist clue. That's awesome. Let's check out the clue real quick. Let's see what that leads us to. What do we got? Oh, this branch, the Polyponesian League. And we have enough to unveil another cultist. 
Silenos. We will destroy your statues. We will burn down your temples if that's what it takes to rid the world of rodents like you. His location is currently unknown, so I'm guessing he is tied to... Oh, he might be the leader of Paros. Yeah, that makes sense. And what is this? Oh, okay, another lead to the sage. The sage is a Spartan king. Okay, cool. Alright, so I think we have a little bit more time. Let's go ahead and see if we can do another mission. <clears throat> Hello, big guy. You may speak. Ships from Paros have blockaded the harbor. Ooh. God curse Silanos and his damned cult. Do they never tire of meddling? Oh. There's my ship. Tell them Let's I'm do on my it. Way. A blockade? I've refused to pay tribute to Athens, and Paros is taking advantage of the situation. There goes our hope of striking first. I can bring my ship around and clear the harbor. Just you against an entire blockade? You have no idea, lady. I got this. You're right. It's terrible odds for Paros. Be safe and come back to me, lamb. Of course, I got this. Let's do it. I'm glad that I actually get to use my ship because I was going around and, you know, of course, as I do, and see all the stuff that there is to see. And my ship is fully upgraded. I'm not sure if I mentioned that before, but yeah, our ship is fully upgraded. And for my lieutenants, I'm trying to focus on arrow damage because arrows have the longest range. So we might as well bump those up as much as possible because we use them pretty much all the time i typically only use the javelins when they're closer because they have such short range but let's get in here and let's destroy these athenian ships i'm sure barnabas will love that let's do it let's go ladies all right who's first you All right, let's wrap around here. They're probably gonna try to ram me. Okay, we didn't take much damage from that. Let's wrap around. All right, let's brace. All right, let's use some javelin seeing as they're close. All right, these little fast ships, they love to ram. Let's go ahead and brace again. See if I can get some javelins on them. Okay, I hit him a little bit. Let's start with a fire thing. I want to get some ramming in of my own. But we're going to have to wait until they get a little lower on health. Barnabas, we're not worried about salvage right now. Alright, let's get a little farther away from these guys. Just to get a little bit of distance. Alright, let's work on this ship. Alright, come on. Alright. Brace. Brace again. We're going to take out this small ship first. There we go. Last hit. Okay, we're going to wrap around and we're going to break this ship in half. Alright, come on. Drift the boat. Let's break the ship in half and then go on the other ones. Okay, that ship's done. Let's start working on this one now. What brace? Ooh. Where's that other ship at? Over there. Okay. We'll focus on this one first, seeing as it is almost on fire. Nope, the fire is going away. It doesn't matter. We'll focus on this one. Alright, let's get fire on them. 
I typically use fire, then I go for regular arrows. Because you can sort of shoot them off one after the other. So we'll get some fire in a second. I just gotta hit them again. Okay, here we go. Fire. Regular arrows. Brace. I could go for a ram, but it might be a little bit too close to that other ship. Alright, let's go for another... Well, oh, brace. Fire does quite a lot of damage. Alright, let's get out of here before they ram me. Alright, we're gonna ram this guy. Well, oh, brace. Yep, just keep bracing. Alright, here we go. Let's board this one. We'll, des we'll destroy that last one after we take care of these guys. There we go. Oh, I thought you were going to go off the edge. Pretty much have this guy stun locked. Alright, you know what? You're going to kick you off the ship. Get out of here. Have a nice day. Alright, time for the big weapons. Okay, you're done. Let's go for you. What are you doing? Just stop. Alright, let's go get my loot. Can't forget the loot. Now, I wonder if I still have to shoot an arrow at this ship. Or will it just sink on its own accord? It'll probably just sink. Come on. There we go. Okay, that's two out of three. Let's wrap around and get this guy. I don't have enough to do a bunch of fire arrow volleys, so let's do a little bit of these. Oh, Reese. Definitely don't want to take too much damage from those arrows. That was a good hit. Alright, here we go. Fire arrows, regular arrows. Fire arrows, regular arrows. Yep, this is my this is my routine. Look how fast you take down that ship when you alternate between your fire and your regular ones. Alright, we're gonna split this one in half. Here we go. Have a nice day. I love the ship stuff in this game. Like I said before, Black Flag was one of my favorites. And this has definitely improved on that formula. It's way better in this game. But now that that's done, let's head back to Marine. I wonder if she's at the docks this time. Yeah, it looks like it. Coming in a little too hot there. There we go. I can't wait to get a new all-women crew because I really do like the way that they sound when they sing. I think I get another one by killing all the legendary animals, so I'll probably do that sometime. But let's talk to her. The harbor is clear. We need to move out before they send reinforcements. We're almost ready. Timo? The ships are loading now. They'll be ready on your command. Cassandra? A word. Of course. Whatever you need. The cult must be stopped. When we return to Laconia, it will be dangerous. I'm used to it. We both are. Here, I know who I can and cannot trust. I would have said that about Sparta too, but this news about the king. Did Aspasia find out which of the kings is working with the cult? For all we know, it's both. We must cleanse Sparta of its corruption, no matter the cost. Okay, we can do that. We should focus on Paros, I stand with you. At least now, we can face them together. Yes. For all that those bastards tried to take from us. And your brother. We will find him. Come see me when you're ready. Are you ready to sail? I'm ready, where are we sailing? Where to? We're going to destroy the fleet of Paros once and for all. Only then will Naxos be secure enough for us to leave. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do that in the next episode, so I'm gonna say I'm not I ready. I have a few things to do here first. We sail as soon as you've prepared. Okay, so that is going to bring us to the end of this episode. 
it looks like in the next episode we're gonna get a little bit more of the ship combat which is always awesome at least for me but anyways let me know what you guys think of this episode i'm probably gonna record the next episode now anyway so i won't see your comments but like i said that's going to bring us to the end of this episode if you guys enjoyed it leave a like and consider subscribing and also do me a favor and click the notification bell so you can be notified when i post if you didn't like it however leave a comment let me know why thank you all for watching and i will see you in the next one later